The most dangerous game. The door is answered by Ivan, a deaf servant who can't speak, and the island's owner, General Zarov. He's a nobleman who escaped Russia after the revolution. He's read one of Rainsford's hunting books. In a hall with mounted animal heads, Zarov explains that he had become bored with hunting. It was no longer a challenge to kill any animal, so he had to hunt a new kind of prey, one that could reason. After a bit more conversation, Rainsford realizes that Zarov hunts sailors. That land on the island, Zarov gives them supplies and a three-hour head start. If the prey can survive for three days, Zarov lets them go. So far, no prey has won this dangerous game. Rainsford considers this murder and won't participate. Zarov says that, like all his victims. Rainsford has a choice of playing the game or being whipped by Ivan. Rainsford agrees to play and heads out into the jungle. Trying not to panic, he creates a trail that is difficult to track and lies motionless in a tree hidden by leaves. Even in the dark, Zarov tracks him. However, like a cat playing with a mouse, he saves Rainsford for another day's sport.